Hello everyone, welcome back to Shattered Planets. When we last left off, we had completed our very first campaign stage, known as the Data Log. We can complete the stage again, apparently, but our only reward is a crate. A mystery crate. Which is not too bad, but still, not worth the effort. We can continue on to the signal, or even move on to the crazy hard old blood. But I think we'll save that for later. Or we can just continue with Explorer Mode, as we have used up our daily challenge. I'm gonna save Explorer Mode for later, let's do the signal! I, I feel like that's the other one wasn't as hard as it should have been, so I'm ready to do the signal. Well, almost. I'm not quite ready to do the signal, because I want to uh, improve myself in some way. Which, that way would be by checking out the equipment that's available. And, uh, maybe getting something new. Although... Well... I mean, it looks like I'm pretty well kitted out, so I've got a hatchling. Well, uh, yeah, I could I could get a better follower besides a hatchling. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. Give me another... I know it's 40 crystals, and that's a lot. But give me another nest companion. Another nest guardian. I will take him. And I will trade the hatchling for a nest guardian, and we'll use the hatchling later, at a later date, maybe. Alright, so I've got a custard blossom, which looks delicious, I love custard. Bandages, which heal for some amounts that I do not know of. And a nest guardian, which is incredible. I have a nest guardian companion that was extremely hurt when I last uh, looked at him. However, that's probably changed. I'm noticing that the Omnicorp visor gives two defense, which... It seems like defense is hard to come by, considering this is a five-star piece of armor and only it gives you two defense. And the character type I am gives two defense, so I didn't think two defense was a lot, but apparently it's more than I thought. Anyways, let's try the signal. I'm a little bit worried about how this is going to turn out, but I, uh, I feel like I'm pretty well kitted out, so this is a good time to try. All right, Clone 001, you know the dark evil stuff that glows behind you, or grows around here? It destroys everything, I call it the blight. There's a signal from deep in the planet where we thought nothing could survive. If we find that signal, maybe we can find a cure. Let's find it for science! Wow, okay, a cure for the blight. That sounds great. Let's do it for science. Oh, that's a turret. That's a turret. Uh, the turret shoots in straight lines. Cool, my companion is at full health. Uh, it's not necessary to fight the laser turret, but I guess if you want to. You know, more scrap metal. Alright, well thank you. Thank you, companion. I wasn't sure if my companion would be at full health, but that is awesome. My companion survived and is fully healed. He, he was... I used that companion just the right amount last adventure. That was... That's perfect. That is perfect. I must admit. Hello, little robot dude. I think I'm going to let my companion fight you. Because I prefer to have my companion do all the fighting. Because I'm worried about my companion turning on me, and I've also got an extra companion. And, uh, well, it's not as bad if my companion dies in comparison to me dying. Alright, I know where the teleporter is. That's good news. And I'm using a key. What treasures will be awarded to me? Ooh, that looks like a guy that is, uh, he's look, looking pretty serious. Alright, I know what to do now. Remove Plasma Blade, punch Crystal, get rewards. Because my Plasma Blade sets everything on fire. Yeah, we're just going to ignore Mr. Evil-looking robots for now. Of course, I, I'm a little bit worried about getting behind all these robots. This place does look a little bit scary. Uh, I want to assist you, but I do not want to set everything on fire. Actually, I'll assist you here. Ooh, there goes my friend! Ooh, good... Ow! Sliced! I, I am the sliced. The sliced Tegan. So they call me now. I have, uh, certainly been sliced. Alright, I'm just gonna flee out of here. Unless another robot comes my way, and that's a problem. Okay, good, good, good. Just keep going away, robots. I said keep going away, robot. Please keep going away. All right. I'm just gonna leave. I am going to leave. And no one is going to stop me. See ya. I know there's a lot left to explore, but we are doing a stage. With a clear objective. And I feel like just 
just letting my companion get killed like that is also is already pretty bad. But I did it for uh, for science, for uh, actually for items. The signal looks like a distress beacon. Maybe there's something in trouble. Keep going. That's my imagination of what I imagine a gecko person would sound like. I don't know. I imagine it's a voice that has a little bit of extra tone. <laughs> Anyways. Hey, laser turrets. Let's avoid that. I cannot avoid that. It's just going to shoot me if I stand here or... Okay, good. The bushes. Thank you, bushes. I salute you. Those bushes are a lot tougher than they look. What's your range? Not long enough. Good. Oh, there's another key card over there. But he's gonna shoot me if I step there, right? So I might as well. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm going. I'm going to engage you. Slash, and you're on fire. Ouch! Those things hurt more than I thought they would. Okay, maybe that wasn't the best decision. Should I deploy the Nest Guardian? Should I use the red bottle? What should I do? How much fire damage are you going to take? Not enough. How long is that going to last? Alright, well. Oh, we, uh, okay, well, if it kills it, it kills it. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Okay, it killed it. I have discovered, I have, well, I discovered the light turrets, but at great cost. At great cost to my uh, entrails. Alright, uh, we're going to bandage. Ah, regenerating, okay. I may have used that bandage prematurely. Well, we might as well get injured a little, I guess, considering we're generating. Uh, yeah, you're on fire, but not enough. Why those bridges can't catch fire? All right, I took full advantage of my regeneration. Oh, the bridges can catch fire, okay. It's, it's funny, that used to be a bridge, but now it's solid dirt. That's a little bit unnerving, but I guess it works. A gun! An allergen! Uh, oh, uh, uh, it's an allergic. Uh, or the mystery crates. <laughs> oh, those mystery crates are always so tempting. I don't think I want an allergen gun. Status effects are a little bit... only has one bullet, and the status effects are a little bit... It's difficult to know whether or not it's going to work. It's like, haha, I'm a boss creature slash robot, and I do not care for your... Thingies. Ooh, but I like my scrap because it, it gives me more power in the long run. I think I'm going to avoid the temptation of the loot crate for now. But the mystery, oh, the mystery, it, it tantalizes me so. That's all that was over here? Well, that was a shame. Oh, well, can't win them all. This looks like a side route. A pink bottle. Sounds from No, that was the incorrect, incorrect button. I don't want to mess with Mr. Robot. I do not want to mess with Mr. Robot, but I want the scrap. But I want the scrap. And I want whatever that is. Okay. A challenge appears! Species identified human. The probe is nice. Proposition. A proposed action. Riddle. Challenge. Accept. I accept your challenge because I am a witty fellow. And fate was on my side, success! What goes on? It, it's human. You interrupt. It's human. It's a human you interrupt. Fine. Oh, what goes on? Four legs, three legs. Yep. I know that one, but I wouldn't have interrupted that fast. Because that's pretty confident. Fine. Plus ten wits, you encountered an intelligent orb that wanted to pose a riddle. But... You said... I do not want to fiddle. With your riddle. So, now I've got a robot friend. My life is what he wants to end. Fighting him I do not recommend. Unless a pincer. Movement. Alright, I got away! Hooray! I am a philosopher! For I ask... Why, oh why, do I have to die? You have to get closer, okay, well. Then I will, then I will. I want that scrap. It's all shiny. Oh, there's a laser cannon, but it can't reach that far. But the blight, the blight is coming. 
glad the blight is slow. Money. All right, well, let's avoid the eyes in the darkness. All right then, I have found the exits. Well, I'm a little bit more adventurous than that. But that looks highly daunting. What was that explosion? You know what, forget it, forget it. Or yeah, that, that thing's gonna be coming for me. Yeah, you know what, forget it, forget it, I uh... All right, yeah. <laughs> there's uh, there's corrupted monsters coming after me. I'll, I'll, I'll just, I'll just see it, yeah. Goodbye, goodbye, yeah. That was an easy stage. Yendor Corporation Labs. That's a NetHack reference. The Amulets of Rodney. It's Rodney backwards. Now I can hear your signal close by. SOS Rodney backwards. That's... What's that mean? What's a Yendor? Well, it's a Rodney. Backwards. That's the... The, the, uh, the hero of NetHack had to collect the magical Amulet of Rodney. Which I believe... Was Rodney somebody the developer of the game knew or something? I forget. Ew, do I want to try experimental fluids or summon my animal companion? Or do I just want to get shot once and run away? Yes, I believe. Oh, oh, right in the... Right in the gonads. <laughs> Alright, so is this the direction I want to be going? Considering I took a bullet to get here, I'm gonna probably say yes. We don't want to jump down, are you crazy? Oh, you're, you're crazy, blood. All right, it looks like I made my decision to advance. Okay, I think I can take you at least, I guess. I don't want to encounter any more baddies, so I'm gonna back up. Please stop following me, solenoid robot. Okay, he's on fire. My health is feeling a bit dire. Let him burn. Okay. Uh. Well. One of these potions could potentially kill me if it explodes, right? Okay, I'm scorched. Ow, 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 ow. I'm on fire. Guess I'll just. No, don't throw it. Don't throw it. Use it. Thank you. Oh, was that too much? Wait, and I can throw it? No. Did, was I not hurt enough for that? It said 80 health. Oh, I think I did my math properly. I wonder what the red bottle does. I probably should call my animal companion soon. But my animal companion is a bit... Ah. Now we know this is flammable liquid. My co animal companion is a bit dumb when it comes to lasers. Let's just go the other way. I don't want to fight robots. I don't like fighting robots. I think that's, yeah, just the dead end down there. I don't think there's anything left down there, so I gotta go this way. I don't want to fight the robot. Can I get through here without fighting that robot? I would like to. I'd really like to. It doesn't look like I'm gonna have such luck. And is there another exit? I don't even think there is another exit to this area. Okay, well, he sees me. That's great. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna play walk around the table with you. Aha, there's another exit. Oh, but I'm gonna piss off another robot and get a pincer situation. I can feel it already. Oh, okay, well... Animal companion, I summon you. I need your help. We have a battle for us to fight. It's not going to be easy. Let's not engage that turret. Or I could just say, uh, good luck. Oh, okay. Well, that that was uh, that was a decision I made. I kind of feel bad, you know, because I essentially just sacrificed my friends. But that's the kind of decision you have to make when you're an explorer, a scorched explorer. Okay. The Bright Hive. Deep in the core of Yendor Labs, Brolin Blight has overrun security systems and continues to grow unchecked. That's it, you're there! The beacon must be nearby! Find it! Find it! Ooh. 
What have I done? Uh, that's strange. The signal, it stopped. But the blight. No, no! Glow one, get out of there! The blight is growing like mad! I can't! Holy. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. And let me guess, you're gonna follow me? Oh, good, it's not following me. Okay, okay, good news, good news. Kill that creature. What does this do? Thank you for being healing. Oh, thank you. Oh, I needed that so much. Okay, the bright's the blight is growing, but I want the flames to go out again. Ow, this hurts so bad. What's that? Oh, the amulet of the Endor. Oh, oh, applies blight immunity. Pulses with ancient energy. Oh, it's a helmet, but plus five defense. I will wear the amulet of Yendor, and I get a bonus. Cool. All right, I've got flammable liquid, but I don't think that's gonna save me. Oh, oh, immune. Okay, good, 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 good lord. Oh, yes, the amulet of Yendor will save me. He died. Go away, fire. Go away. Well, I'm immune to the blight anyway, so actually I don't have to worry about the blight. Uh -huh, I'm immune to your blight. I have the amulet of Yendor. I have the cure to the blight. I am the chosen one. And, uh, was that the face I chose? I chose a slightly different face from my renegade, didn't I? Well, I think I've done it. I should have worn the amulet of Yendor right from the start. I wasn't paying attention. I didn't know that the amulet of Yendor was a wearable item. I almost got scrooged by that monster. We've done it. All right. Signal challenge complete. And just barely, too. A hundred crystals. I did get two nest companions killed, but I got one back, so... I would say that's a, uh... An in-end profit of 60 crystals, basically. Hey, Clone 001, you made it out alive? I didn't, uh... I mean, fantastic! I'll need to recalibrate a few things to beam you back home, because I was expecting it so much that, uh... I didn't have it ready. Hold on! Here's something to watch while you wait. Shattered planets. <laughs> Credits. Again. They really want you to look at these four people in particular. And good for them. And everyone else. Yay! You're so happy that I enjoyed your game. And I have, actually. It's just... Not, maybe not the most in-depth game, but I'm enjoying... Enjoying it immensely. Hey, I get to keep the amulet of Yendor. Cool. All right. Immunity to uh to, to the blight. Well, I've got a lot of good stuff. Guess I'm gonna put back the Omnicorp visor. To five defense. That thing's incredible. This thing's incredible. Fourteen strength. I think I'm gonna take the Kaiju Killer instead of the Plasma Blade. The Plasma Blade is causing me a lot more problems than I would expect it to. Uh, oh, you can recycle items. I wonder what kind of fee you get for recycling things. Or what kind of reward. Well, I, I'm having a lot of weapons. I have a lot of weapons, so let me get rid of this, uh, this mallet here. Four scrap. Yeah, that's not much. Okay, but it's something. All right, so I have at least. Oh, there's multiple pages. Okay, so actually, I didn't. I didn't need to do that, but well, I probably didn't need that anyways. So kaiju killer, or do I want the machete? Eight to twelve, fourteen. Eight to twelve, fourteen strength. Plus six wits and four fates. Actually, the rusty machete is better than every way. Okay, fine. You know what's better than a kaiju killer? A rusty machete! Plus, the rusty machete allows you to uh, harvest things. Which is pretty awesome. So yes, the amulet of Yendor, plus a machete. And uh, I like this kind of face. He looks more Australian, I might say. Don't know why, but I would say that this guy looks more Australian than the other guy I just was. The Renegade. I guess I, I lost my face when I switched characters. I was checking out other characters. I haven't unlocked any new characters yet. And I would like to upgrade my character. I guess more defensiveness would be good, so more health. And, uh... Well, you know what? More health. Why not? More health and more health. Just because I perfectly had the cash. Or the health twice. 
And as far as crystals are concerned, molecular, molecular vaccination. Temporary chemical shield. Metal detector. Basically, that's a trade of crystals and scrap. And, uh, yeah, I can get new equipment. But I've got a lot of good equipment for now, so I'm just gonna hold on to my crystals. Or I know one thing. I, I love, I love nest companions, so let me get another nest companion. Yeah, we love nest companions. In fact, oh, I have three in storage. I got a three pack in storage. You can stack them. You can stack them. I can have a stack of four nest guardians. I can bring a small army into combat with me. Well, that's something. That is something. I wasn't expecting that. Should I be saving those up? I don't know. I'm gonna take them all. You just, you gotta, you gotta take them all. You gotta take them all. And I'll take the hatchling and I'll just start with the hatchling and then use the nest companions as I'm traveling along. I'm gonna be spending a ginormous amount of crystals, but you know what? You do that anyways in this game, so. Yeah, I guess that's what I'm doing. All right, well, I am going to have a lot of fun with this game in the future. I am getting rather powerful, and I enjoy that fact. So, I'll see you next time, Galactic Explorers on the Shattered Planet. I'll see you then. Good night.